Okay, today I'm gonna to show you in a quick tutorial how to install Figma MCP so that you can use cursor to talk to Figma directly. So the first thing you wanna do is to go to GitHub cursor dash talk to Figma MCP and then copy this command. Okay, go back to terminal and paste this command in. This will install a package called BUN, which will be essential when setting up Figma MCP in the future. After installing it, we need to set a system pass. To do so, very straightforward. Just copy the command that I have in the link description over here to the terminal. And then just type source dash dot zshrc. This will finish setting up system pass for BUN. Now let's go back to the GitHub page, click on code and click on download zip. After downloading and unzipping it, open up cursor, click on open project, go to the download folder and open up this file. And then open up the terminal and just type BUN setup. Here it says new MCP server detected, talk to Figma, click on enable. Next, click on cursor, click on settings, click on cursor settings, go to MCP tools, and you should see talk to Figma right here. Okay, next, let's open up a Figma file. Right click on the canvas, click on plugin, and go to manage plugins, and then you search for talk to Figma MCP. This is the one right here. Click on run. Next, let's go back to the GitHub page and copy this command, BUN space socket. And after that, let's go back to cursor. In the terminal, just paste this command and run it. So after running this, you should see WebSocket server running on port 3055. This is very important. Once you see this, you can hop back to Figma and click on connect. So now the Figma is connected to the MCP server. Then again, go back to the GitHub page, copy this command, BUNX space cursor talk to Figma dash MCP. Go back to cursor, open up a new terminal and paste this in, run it. Then you should see something like this, received broadcast message, please join a channel to start chatting. Okay, now, this means everything's ready to go. Go to the AI pin and just type talk to Figma. So here cursor says to talk to Figma, I need a name of a Figma channel or link to a Figma file. To get this channel name, it's very easy. Go back to Figma and copy this channel name here. Paste it in the AI pin and enter. This means you're now connected to your Figma file specifically for the page design preview. So now everything's connected, you can start using it. Okay, now let's just do a simple experiment. Let's copy the name of this slides and say in cursor, please delete this page. Okay, you can see this page is gone, which means the MCP is working. Okay, that's it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed it.